Uh, Mr Speaker, when the Prime Minister wrote at the weekend that she wanted as little friction as possible, <laughs> was she talking about EU trade or the next Cabinet meeting? <laughs> I think the Right Honourable Gentleman knows full well that this Government has a policy of leaving the Customs Union, of leaving the Customs Union, of leaving the Customs Union and of ensuring that as we do so, we have as frictionless trade as possible with the EU, that we have a, a solution which ensures we have no hard border between Northern Ireland and Ireland, and also and also that we have an independent trade policy. But if he's talking if he's talking about friction, perhaps he could reflect on the fact that this month the Shadow Health Minister in the Lords voted for a second referendum. That, that at the weekend the Shadow Brexit Secretary refused to rule out a second referendum. And on Monday the Shadow International Development Minister tweeted in favour of a second referendum. So perhaps when he stands up he could put the minds of the British people in this House at rest and rule out a second referendum. So I told her, yeah, you know who I am Cause on the really, who else can it be?